coming in. Okay. Finally got to the show. Let's go. Earlier this year, we announced a new collaboration with the creators of Fortnite, Epic Games, to develop a new entertainment universe. How many of you in the audience today play Fortnite? Let's go. Right, that's great. So you probably recognized our in-game live stream that we showed just a second ago. This is a pretty big moment. Right now, Fortnite players from around the world are watching our show from inside the game. Yes, sir. The Let's go. They just told me there are more than 1 million people watching right now. Let's go. And you know what? This is just the beginning. What we're working on with Epic is grounded in gaming, but it's going to be so much more than that. We're inviting you to play with Disney in completely new ways. So imagine a place where all your favorite Disney characters and worlds they converge into one connected universe. Imagine a place where you can watch, Ooh. play, even create your own Disney stories. I like that. Imagine turning everything that you love about Disney into a digital playground that you can play 365 days a year. Yeah. Yeah, we are bringing the full power of Disney storytelling to this dynamic new environment. To talk more about it, please welcome some of the best storytellers in the world, Jennifer Lee, Pete Doctor, Dave Filoni, and Kevin Feige. Let's go. Woo. Thank you guys for coming wow. out. Exciting night at D23. Be careful there, Pete. Uh, you all shared some great news last night, so thanks for coming back on, on night two to D23. Uh, we've been talking about the possibilities for this collaboration with Epic Games. Uh, hundreds of millions of our fans have already played with our characters inside of Fortnite. Now we have a great opportunity for new ways to tell stories. Ben, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start with you. How do you see our classic animated characters evolving in this new universe that we're yeah. talking about? Well, Josh, I can tell you that everyone at Disney Animation is so excited about the potential that we see in the collaboration with Epic. And I am especially excited because my daughter lets me watch her play Fortnite, like, <laughs> for hours. Is she one of the <laughs> million people watching now, maybe? She may just be right now yeah. on Disney Horizons Island. So <laughs> Let's go. Hi, Agatha. It's your mom. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not embarrassing you at all right now in front of a million people. So. But seriously, we can't wait to create new ways for the audience to enjoy their favorite Disney characters and worlds. And now I know that this Disney universe is still in development, but... We didn't want to wait to share something with the Fortnite fans, which is why I am so excited that we are bringing Disney animation characters to the game for the first time this fall. Let's go! We love it! Oh boy, we got the villains. Oh shit. Ooh. 
spooky, spooky times. Let's go. Yes, sir, bro. Corella, Captain Hook. We out here, man. Play violent style. Let's go. Wow. Yeah, and that, cool. that looks, it looks pretty amazing. And you're right, bringing these characters into Fortnite, it's just scratching the surface of what we're talking about here with, with Epic Games. Pete, congratulations. Congratulations on the success of Inside Out 2. Pete Docker. Yeah. Good movie. Good movie. The biggest Pixar film, in, in, animated film in history. It's, it's amazing. So yes, sir, dude. Thank you. It's pretty crazy. We couldn't be more proud of our team. They did a fantastic job. Well, we all know that innovation is such a, a crucial part of storytelling, and it's fundamental to everything that Pete, you do and your team do at Pixar. So getting to play in this new Epic Games universe, it feels kind of like a natural fit for you. Oh, yeah. I mean, from Toy Story on, we've always looked at technology as a great partner with the storytelling that we're trying to do. Pushing boundaries of technology so we can tell new stories is really what we do. And I feel like, in a way, this is a little uh, reminds me of our short films, which we use to, use to test new technology and play with characters. And I really could see this as an extension of that process. Uh, we're excited about playing with new original ideas in formats with Epic. So the poss possibilities are endless. And you know, Jen, I didn't want to have you let you and, and your daughter and, and the, the, the Walt Disney uh, animation have all the fun. So I am also thrilled to announce the first Pixar characters are coming to Fortnite this fall. Let's go! Yes, yeah, sir. Yes, yeah, sir. Incredibles in Fortnite, bro. Oh my god, dude. Let's go. This is a good time. Oh, we love that. Oh, we love that. We love the Incredibles around here. Let's go. Let's go. Yes. Dave, I'm coming to you next. What, what you what you got for Lucasfilm? You, you got to show these two guys up, I'm sure. Yeah, we've we've been in Fortnite a little bit here, blowing things up and blasting things. The best thing about this announcement is you're gonna get this stuff next week. No way. <laughs> Let's go. I must warn you, it will draw many eyes. When one chooses to walk the way of Ooh. the Mandalore. You are both hunter and prey. This is the way. Yeah, more Star Wars. Let's go. Grogu, the boy. <laughs> Here we are. Let's go. Good shit. Yeah, maybe I can get a little bit of that back bling myself. I, I, I don't know. Yeah. But Dave, as we as we look out to this new universe, it, it seems to play to, to your strengths. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, I mean, absolutely. I mean, video games, Star Wars, George Lucas always believed in the kind of integration. We've blasted the Death Star in our lives, playing in old vector games as technology's improved, the graphics has improved. And a lot of times we're recreating the movies getting in that galaxy far, far and away. But now, you know, through the integration, we've even used gaming technology like Epic's Unreal Engine yeah. in shows like The Mandalorian in our environment. Okay. So we're always constantly looking for new ways to really take you, the fans, to our galaxy. That's and sick. We're working on it. We're really excited about this collaboration with Epic and what it can mean for our galaxy and our storytelling. So uh, we're going to get you there uh, as soon yeah. as we can. I completely agree with you, Dave. And, you know, since you're here... Why don't we tell everybody about that other thing that we've been working on? Yeah, this I'm really <laughs> excited about. If you're ever in the park, sometimes you might see me and a friend of mine named John Favreau. We love the park. Yeah, John, he's the best. Uh, we love riding the rides and, and just going around Star Tours, all different things. Uh, 
We did a little research last Thursday in the park, yeah. rode a particular ride a couple times because currently we're shooting a new movie called The Mandalorian and Grogu. Uh, be out in 2026. Oh. Oh. <laughs> fans, uh, we really Let's go. You guys asked us to take a look at one of the rides and we're going to share something really cool. Uh, we are working with the Disney Imagineers to do a new Mandalorian and Grogu story for the Millennium Falcon ride smuggler's ride. Let's go. Oh, Yes, dude. We love it. We love that. We love that. Bro, listen, flying the Millennium Falcon this is fire. Mando and Grogu sounds like a Star Wars dream come true. And of course, we're going to use the Unreal Engine to create it. So this whole thing comes comes full circle. This is so fire. Right, hey, thank you, D23, and may the force be with you. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. <laughs> dude, yeah, they just went off for Lucasfilm. That's crazy. Already huge. In, yes. in Fortnite, yeah. and the response that we've seen yes. is fantastic. It's been amazing. Let's go. Back to 2018, the relationship we've had with the Epic is great. Yep. 2018 is when Thanos first started. Thanos! That was so fire. Infinity War movie. Uh, a few years after that, Galactus came and destroyed the whole island. And some <laughs> of you, or the million, did you say million, John? Million People plus, watching, I said. Uh, may have seen that clip. That clip of Galactus destroying the island of Fortnite is so cool. I shared it with the team currently making the Fantastic Four movie to get that spirit of Galactus across. Nice. Incredible. Let's go. To do. And what else I love in my 11 year old son who plays Fortnite every day, a lot of people learn about our characters for the first time Thanos, Galactus through Fortnite. That's crazy. So we get a chance that everybody can learn about our heroes and our villains for the first time, and that inspires them to then go look at our comics. Go on Disney Plus, go to our movies. So this new collaboration is really remarkable. Remarkable games have become an extension of our storytelling, and I can't wait for everybody to see what we have in store in the future with this amazing collaboration. But that's the future. In the here and now, we have something I'm very excited to announce. Tonight, the next season of Marvel at, on Fortnite, next week, August 16th. <laughs> And this, well, let's go. <laughs> and like Thanos and Galactus before him, there's a very iconic villain coming. It is a character you may have heard us speak about over the last couple of it's weeks. It's going to be Doctor Doom. Coming to Fortnite is Doctor Doom. I knew it. Let's go, dude. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Oh, my God. Dude, a Marvel season for Fortnite. Who do you guys? That is so crazy. Let's go! Oh, we got the shield, bro. Oh, we got the claws. Oh, my. Okay, okay. Repulsors. We are so back. We are so back. We are back. This looks so fire. Let's go! Oh my god. Fort or Marvel season? Oh my god, dude. I don't mean to sound like a broken Yeti, but I thought I'd take this one last chance to pitch my ideas for new stuff in the parks. Take a seat. Today, I'm gonna melt your mind. Like it's a beloved 40 foot animatronic dragon. Welcome to Destination Deadpool 75. Why 75, <laughs> you ask? Because I have 75 slides of Disney Parks pitch goodness in store for you. Seriously, you should probably sit down. Oh my god. There's no chair up here. Isn't your title literally chairman? You know what? We're getting off topic. 
<laughs> Page one. Now that I've slid into your parks like the ill-advised midnight DM, I Bro. need more, and you need more of me. The possibilities are endless. Let's just brown sky. No, 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 it's blue sky. It's blue sky. <laughs> Not when I'm done with it. Wink. Picture this: the Chimichanga Chaser, a dueling coaster attraction where you are the beef. Now pay attention. Because this next one is going to be a bigger hit than an expensive Spider-Man animatronic against a wall. Oh, Halloween coming uh, up. Deadpool's Heck House is here. Deadpool's Even Heck House. Disney, enter the Hall of Baby Arms. And don't forget. The Hall of Baby Arms. Now. You got any Disney Marathon fans out there? Huh? <laughs> See you, guy. Well, if you love the Princess Run and the Villains Run, now you can get ready for Logan's Run. That's right. Fun for the whole family. Oh my god. Except for grandma and grandpa. They're probably gonna hate it. Oh, look, that's cool. I, I, I appreciate, I appreciate whatever all this is, but the answer, Wade, no. Not gonna happen. Oh, come on! Stuart, you've already got a massive movie. I figured that'd be enough for you. Uh, but okay, how about this? We just talked about Epic Games a, a moment ago. What if I let you have, like, a new skin? <gasps> it's behind me, isn't it? No spoilers. I want to see in the game. Is he awesome looking? Does he have really muscles? He's handsome, right? Don't yeah. I guess so. Perfect. Then my work here is done. Hey, thanks again, buddy. You are killing it up here. Seriously, you are on fire. Like your dragon was. Twice. Some imagination, huh? Nice, dude. Let's go. Damn, bro. There we go. There we go. There's your Fortnite times Disney Horizons, dude. Wow. Let's go, dude. That's insane, dude. That is wild, guys. Nice, dude. Let's go. W. W. Okay, I got in here just in time for these ads, so. Vader! Vader boy. Captain Jonesy. Or is that Captain America? Oh, that is Captain America. Let's go, guys. Earlier this year, we announced a new collaboration with the creators of Fortnite, Epic Games, to develop a new entertainment universe. How many of you in the audience today play Fortnite? All right, that's great. So you probably recognized our in-game live stream that we showed just a second ago. This is a pretty big moment right now. 
Fortnite players from around the world are watching our show from inside the game. Let's go. The folks backstage just told me there are more than one million people watching right now. And you know what? This is just the beginning. What we're working on with Epic is grounded in gaming, but it's going to be so much more than that. We're inviting you to play with Disney in completely new ways. So imagine a place where all your favorite Disney characters and worlds, they converge into one connected universe. Imagine a place where you can watch, play, even create your own Disney stories. Imagine turning everything that you love about Disney into a digital playground that you can play 365 days a year. Yeah, we are bringing the full power of Disney storytelling to this dynamic new environment. To talk more about it, please welcome some of the best storytellers in the world, Jennifer Lee, Pete Doctor, Dave Filoni, and Kevin Feige. Let's go. Guys. W's, dude. Guys. Thank you guys for coming wow. out. An exciting night at D23. Be careful there, Pete. Uh, you all shared some great news last night, so thanks for coming back on, on night two to D23. Uh, we've been talking about the possibilities for this collaboration with Epic Games. Uh, hundreds of millions of our fans have already played with our characters inside of Fortnite. Now we have a great opportunity for new ways to tell stories. So Jen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start with you. How do you see our classic animated characters evolving in this new universe that we're yeah. talking about? Well, Josh, I can tell you that everyone at Disney Animation is so excited about the potential that we see in the collaboration with Epic. And I am especially excited because uh, my daughter lets me watch her play Fortnite, like, for hours. Is she one of the <laughs> million people watching now, maybe? She may just be, <laughs> right now, on Disney Horizons Island, so... <laughs> Hi, Agatha. <laughs> it's your mom. <laughs> and I'm not embarrassing you at all, right now. Let's it's go. one of a million people, so... But seriously, we can't wait to create new ways for the audience to enjoy their favorite Disney characters and worlds. And now I know that this Disney universe is still in development, but we didn't want to wait to share something with the Fortnite fans, which is why I am so excited that we are bringing Disney animation characters to the game for the first time this fall. Yes. Let's go! We got the villains! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, sir. Let's go. Looks pretty amazing. And you're right, bringing these characters into Fortnite is just scratching the surface of what we're talking about here with, with Epic Games. Pete, congratulations. <laughs> congratulations on the success of Inside Out 2. Pete Doc. The biggest Pixar film, in, 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 animated film in history. It's, it's amazing, so congratulations. To you. It's pretty crazy, we couldn't be more proud of our team. They did a fantastic job. Well, we all know that innovation is such a, a crucial part of storytelling, and it's fundamental to everything that you do and your team do at Pixar. So getting to play in this new Epic Games universe, it feels kind of like a natural fit for you. Oh yeah, I mean, from Toy Story on, we've always looked at technology as a great partner with the storytelling that we're trying to do. Pushing boundaries of technology so we can tell new stories is really what we do. And I feel like, in a way, this is a little, uh, reminds me of our short films which we use to use to test new technology and play with characters. And I really could see this as an extension of that process. Uh, we're excited about playing with new original ideas in formats with Epic. So the possibilities are endless. And you know, Jen, 
I didn't want to have you let you and and your daughter and and the, the, the Walt Disney uh, animation have all the fun. So I am also thrilled to announce the first Pixar characters are coming to Fortnite this fall. Let's go! Guys. Let's go. Will be bold. Dramatic. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. What you, what you got for Lucasfilm? You, you got to show these two guys up, I'm sure. Yeah, we've we've been in Fortnite a little bit here, blowing things up and blasting things. The best thing about this announcement is you're going to get this stuff next week. Let's go! I must warn you, it will draw many eyes. When one chooses to walk the way of the Mandalore, you are both hunter and prey. This is the way. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Maybe I can get a little bit of that back bling myself. I, I, I don't know. Yeah. But Dave, as we, as we look out to this new universe, it, it seems to play to, to your strengths. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, I mean, absolutely. I mean, video games, Star Wars. George Lucas always believed in the kind of integration. We've blasted the Death Star in our lives, playing in old vector games as technologies improved. The graphics has improved. And a lot of times we're recreating the movies, getting into that galaxy far, far and away. But now, you know, through the integration, we've even used gaming technology like Epic's Unreal Engine yeah. in shows like The Mandalorian in our environment. So we're always constantly looking for new ways to really take you, the fans, to our galaxy. And we're working on it. We're really excited about this collaboration with Epic and what it can mean for our galaxy and our storytelling. So. Uh, we're going to get you there uh, um, as yeah. we can. I completely agree with you, Dave. And, you know, since you're here, why don't we tell everybody about that other thing that we've been working on? Yeah, this I'm really <laughs> excited about. If you're ever in the park, sometimes you might see me and a friend of mine named John Favreau. We love the parks. Yeah, John, he's the best. Uh, we love riding the rides and, and just going around Star Tours, all different things. Uh, we did a little research last Thursday in the park. We yeah. rode a particular ride a couple times because currently we're shooting a new movie called The Mandalorian and Grogu. Woo! And uh, being huge fans, uh, we were really thrilled when Josh, you guys asked us to take a look at one of the rides and we're going to share something really cool. Uh, we are working with the Disney Imagineers to do a new Mandalorian and Grogu story for the Millennium Falcon ride. Woo! <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. So listen, flying the Millennium Falcon alongside Mando and Grogu it sounds like a Star Wars dream come true. And of course, we're going to use the Unreal Engine to create it. So this whole thing comes comes full circle. All right, hey, thank you, D23, and may the Force be with you. <laughs> exactly. Woo! Let's go. It's been already huge. In, yes. in Fortnite, yes. and the response that we've seen, just, just fantastic. It's been amazing, you know, going back to 2018, the relationship we've had with Epic is great. 2018 is when Thanos first stormed across the island in our Infinity Gauntlet event that was time to our Infinity War movie. Uh, a few years after that, that was fire. destroyed the whole island, and some of you, or the million, did you say million, John? Million People plus, watching, I said. Uh, may have seen that clip, that clip of Galactus destroying the island of Fortnite is so cool. I shared it with the team currently making the Fantastic Four movie to get that spirit of Galactus Woo! across. It's incredible what they're able to do 
And what else I love in my 11-year-old son who plays Fortnite every day, a lot of people learn about our characters for the first time, Thanos, Galactus, through Fortnite. So we get a chance that everybody can learn about our heroes and our villains for the first time, and that inspires them to then go look at our comics, go on Disney+, Plus, go to our movies. So this new collaboration is really remarkable. Games have become an extension of our storytelling, and I can't wait for everybody to see what we have in store in the future with this amazing collaboration. But that's the future. In the here and now, we have something I'm very excited to announce tonight. The next season of Marvel at, on Fortnite, next week, August 16th. <laughs> and this, well, let's go. <laughs> and like Thanos and Galactus before him, there's a very iconic villain coming. It is a character you may have heard us speak about over the last couple of weeks. Doctor Doom! Doom! Yeah! Let's go! Let's go! Yes! Let's go! Guys, 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 guys. Let's go! We're about to turn up next season! We're about to turn up! Woo! We are back! Yes, 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 But I thought I'd take this one last chance to pitch my ideas for new stuff in the parks. Take a seat. Today, I'm gonna melt your mind like it's a beloved 40-foot animatronic dragon. Welcome to Destination Deadpool 75. Why 75, you ask? Because I have 75 slides of Disney Parks pitch goodness in store for you. Seriously, you should probably sit down. There's no chair up here. Isn't your title literally chairman? <laughs> you know what? Oh, we're getting off topic. Behold, page one. Now that I've slid into uh, your parks like an ill-advised midnight DM, I need more, and you need more of me. The possibilities are endless. Let's just brown sky for a bit. No, 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 no. it's blue sky. It's blue sky. <laughs> Not when I'm done with it. <laughs> Wink. Picture this. The Chimichanga Chaser. A dueling coaster attraction where you are the beef. Now pay attention, because this next one is going to be a bigger hit than an expensive Spider-Man animatronic against a wall. Halloween coming up. Deadpool's heck house is here. Keeping it clean for you, Disney. Enter the Hall of Baby Arms. Oh. And don't forget, I come as a package deal with Wolverine now. We got any Disney <laughs> Marathon fans out there? Huh? I <laughs> see you, guy. Well, if you love the Princess Run and the Villains Run, now you can get ready for Logan's Run. Oh. That's right. Fun for the whole family. Except for Grandma and Grandpa. <laughs> They're probably going to hate it. Oh, look, Deadpool. I, I, I appreciate, I appreciate w whatever all this is, but the answer, Wade, no. It's not going to happen. Oh, come on! Stuart, you've already got a massive movie. I figured that'd be enough for you. Uh, but okay, how about this? We just talked about Epic Games a, a moment ago. What if I let you have, like, a new skin? <gasps> it's behind me, isn't it? No spoilers. I want to see in the game. Is he awesome looking? Does he have really Woo! Awesome? He's awesome. Perfect. Let's go. It's done. Hey, thanks again, buddy. You are killing it up here. Seriously, you are on fire! 
like your dragon was. Twice. Some imagination, huh? <laughs> Let's go, dude. D23 in Fortnite. There you go, dude. Let's go. Here we go. There it is, boys. There it is, boys. Let's go. Let's go. There it is, my dudes. Yes, sirs. Here we go, dudes. There would be the D23 Fortnite experience, dude. Here it is, my guys. Alright, Thomas will see if these coins. Seems literally like the only one I can reach, though. Okay. Damn, bro. Can't even grab those ones. Damn, bro. Yay, Fortnite! Go, Fortnite! Fortnite, Fortnite, Fortnite! Earlier this year, we announced a new collaboration with the creators of Fortnite Epic Games develop a new entertainment universe. How many of you in the audience today play Fortnite? All right, that's great. So you probably recognized our in-game live stream that we showed just a second ago. This is a pretty big moment. Right now, Fortnite players from around the world are watching our show from inside the game. Damn, how, how can I? The folks backstage just told me there are more than one million people watching right now. Woo! And you know what? This is just the beginning. What we're working on with Epic is grounded in gaming, but it's going to be so much more than that. We're inviting you to play with Disney in That's pretty sick, dude. Ways. So imagine a place where all your favorite Disney characters and worlds, they converge. Josh, I can tell you that everyone at Disney Animation is so excited about the potential that we see in the collaboration with it's Epic. It's my actual show, okay. And I am especially excited because... Uh, my daughter lets me watch her play Fortnite, like, for hours. Is she one of Wait, oh god. People watching now, maybe? Okay, okay, she okay, again. She may just be, right now, on Disney Horizon. Dude, Earth, no so. way. Hi, Agatha. It's your mom. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not embarrassing you at all, right now, in front of a million people, so. But Bruh. me can't wait to create new ways for the audience to enjoy their favorite Disney characters. Give me my coins, bro. And now I know that this Disney universe is still in development. But Here we go, guys. Let's go. Want to wait to 
share something with the Fortnite fans, which is why I am so excited that we are bringing Disney animation characters. No, <laughs> no, dude, no, 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 no. Go, 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 go. Yes, dude, let's go. Turn up. No, <laughs> that's the rock, dude. No, we gotta go back. On brothers. No, dude. <laughs> Give me my coins. Give me my coins, dude. Come on. Let's go, dude. Get hustling, bro. Get hustling. No, come on, game. Congratulations on the success of this. No, no. Let's go. The biggest Pixar film in, in the animated film in history. It's, it's amazing. So congratulations to you. Yeah, thank you. It's pretty crazy. We couldn't be more proud of our team. They did a fantastic job. Well, we all know that innovation is such a, a crucial part of storytelling, and it's fundamental to everything that you, you do in your team with Pixar. So getting to play in this new Epic Games universe it feels kind of like a natural fit. Oh yeah, I mean, from Toy Story on, we've always looked at technology as a great partner with the storytelling that we're trying to do. Pushing boundaries of technology so we can tell new stories is really what we do. And I feel like, in a way, this is a little, uh, reminds me of our short- How do I get all the way over there? Yeah. To, use ...to test new technology and play with characters, and I really- could see this as okay. an extension of that process. Okay, I gotta take a weirdo uh, route. We're excited about playing with new original Heard that. ideas in formats with Epic. So, you. Possibilities are endless. No, and, dude, come know, on. Jen, I didn't want to have you let you and and your daughter and and <laughs> the, the Walt Disney come on, uh, animation have all the fun. So, I am also thrilled to announce the first Pixar characters are coming right this fall. And they are incredible. No. No. Dude, this is a tough point. Come on. Yeah. Let's go, dude. But no, honestly, this looks sick, dude. This looks sick. This is the way. Oh, dude, that's sick. Dude, that is sick. Dude, that is that's sick, bro. Look at that, bro. That is sick, bro. Shout out Disney. Shout out Epic Games, bro. That's so sick, bro. To our galaxy, and we're working on it. We're really excited about this collaboration with Epic and what it can mean for our galaxy and our storytelling. So, uh, we're gonna get you there as uh, soon as we can. Completely agree with you, Dave. And you know, since you're here, that's fire, bro. Why don't we tell everybody about that other thing that we've been working on? Yeah, this I'm really excited about. If you're ever in the park, sometimes you might see me and a friend of mine named John Favreau. We love the parks. Yeah, John, he's the best. Uh, we love riding the bikes and, and just going around Star Wars, all different things. Uh, we 
did a little research last Thursday in the park. We yeah. rode a particular ride a couple times because currently we're shooting a new movie called The Mandalorian and Grogu. Let's go, dude. Uh, be out in 2026. <laughs> and, uh, Woo! Fans, uh, we were really thrilled when Josh, you guys asked us to take a look at one of the rides, and we're going to share something really cool. Uh, we are working with the Disney Imagineers to do a new Mandalorian and Grogu story for the Millennium Falcon. Woo! Woo! Well, listen, flying the Millennium Falcon alongside Mando and Grogu sounds like a Star Wars dream come true. And of course, we're going to use the Unreal Engine to create it, so this whole thing comes, comes full circle. All right, hey, thank you, D23, and may the Force be with you. <laughs> exactly. Woo! <laughs> Coming over to you. Marvel's been already huge in, in yeah. Fortnite. Yeah. And the response that we've seen, just, just fantastic. It's been amazing. You know, it's going back to 2018, the relationship we've had with the Epic is great. Let's go, dude. First stormed across the island in our Infinity Gauntlet event. It was time for Woo! Infinity War movie. Uh, a few years after that, Galactus came and destroyed the whole island. And some of you... The got all the coins, boys. We got all the coins. Uh, may have seen that clip. That clip of Galactus destroying the island of Fortnite is so cool. I shared it with the team currently making the Fantastic Four movie to get that spirit of Galactus across. It's incredible what they're able to do. And what else I love, and my 11 year old son who plays Fortnite every day, a lot of people learn about our characters for the first time. Fan of Galactus through. That's Fortnite. absurd, bro. So, get a chance that everybody can learn about our heroes and our villains for the first time and that inspires them to then go look at our comics go on disney plus go to our movie so this new collaboration is really remarkable games have become an extension of our storytelling and i can't wait for everybody to see what we have in store in the future with this amazing collaboration but that's the future in the here and now we have something i'm very excited to announce tonight the next season of Marvel at, on Fortnite next week. Woo! <laughs> and this, let's Look go. at that, Disney. And like Thanos That's so cool, bro. Him, there's a very iconic. Very, very cool. It is a character you may have heard very, of very cool, dude. Over the last couple of weeks. Coming to Fortnite. Shout out Disney. Shout out Fortnite, bro. Woo! Now we have an official trailer here. Do you guys want to see the trailer? It's like Disney World and Fortnite. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Go. Let's go. But I thought I'd take this one last chance to pitch my ideas for new stuff in the parks. Take a seat. Today, I'm going to melt your mind like it's a beloved 40 foot animatronic dragon. Welcome to Destination Deadpool 75. Why 75, you ask? Because I have 75 slides of Disney Parks pitch goodness in store for you. Seriously, you should buy this today. There's no chair up here. Isn't your title literally chairman? You know what? Look at it. Behold! 
Page one. Now that I've slid into your parks like an ill-advised midnight DM, I need more, and you need more of me. The possibilities are endless. Let's just brown sky. No, no, no. Blue sky. Blue sky. <laughs> Not when I'm done with it. Wink. Picture this. The Jimmy Chang the Chaser. A dueling coaster attraction where you are the beast. Now pay attention. This next one is going to be a bigger hit than an expensive Spider-Man animatronic against a wall. Halloween coming up. Deadpool's heck house is here. Keeping it clean for you, Disney. Enter the home of baby arms. And don't forget, I come as a package deal with Wolverine now. We got any Disney Marathon fans out there? Huh? I <laughs> see you, guy. Well, if you love the princess run and the villains run, now you can get ready for Logan's run. That's right. Fun for the whole family. Except for Grandma and Grandpa. They're probably gonna hate it. <laughs> Deadpool. I, 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 I appreciate, I appreciate whatever all this is, but the answer, Wade, no, it's not gonna happen. Come on! Woo! Stupid. You've already got a massive movie. I figured that'd be enough for you. Uh, but okay, how about this? We just talked about Epic Games a, a moment ago. What if I let you have, like, a new skin? It's behind me, isn't it? No spoilers. I want to see in the game. Is he awesome looking? Does he have red muscles? He's handsome. Woo! Let's go. Seriously, you are on fire. Like your dragon was. Twice. Some imagination, huh? Woo! Here we go, dude. Let's go. There it is, dude. There it is. Let's go. Yes, sir, bro. There it is, bro. There it is, bro. GG's. D23 times Fortnite. Let's go. Yes, dude. W?